Going back to our top story on this BTN Live, Michigan State has suspended Max Buller, the star of their defense, for the bowl game. He will not be playing in the Rose Bowl. Graham Couch from the Lansing State Journal joins us. Graham, you wrote a column about this recently, and you called Buller the football equivalent of Mateen Cleaves. Put into words exactly what he means to this Spartan team. Well, he is not only a leader. I think leader, you can say about a lot of people, is kind of a vague term, but uh, from a football perspective, he is the person who makes all the checks, all the calls. He is the quarterback of the defense and really good at, in real time audibling against the quarterback's audibles uh, and putting what is a very experienced defense in the right defense at, at the last moment. And so from a football perspective, that's, that's enormous because no matter how experienced you are as a defense, it's not something where collectively you can do that. You can't have Danico Salad and Darquez Denard pick up half duties. you got to have one person who, who's, who does that. And he's also the mouthpiece, kind of the soul of the, the team. And that, that's at least the way we all perceive it. And, and how much that is, uh, the defense feels that way, is kind of something we'll, we'll see. I don't know how hard you thought it would be for Michigan State to beat Stanford before this, but how much harder is that task now? I think it's, it's harder. I, I think like I thought the, the point spread moved about a point because of Bull's absence. And Vegas never lets point spreads move too much with um, with one player and, and I think that's probably the sometimes the flaw of, of, of the Vegas line. Like I, I thought I think the six and a half points is probably about right right now and the five and a half that was before Bax Bull was probably wrong. I, I thought Michigan State had a really good chance in this game. I thought this is a team that's proven me wrong enough this season and uh, to the point that you just weren't gonna uh, pick against them. And but yeah, no I think it's I think it's What's hard to quantify is what it matters in terms of kind of the spirit and the voice of the team and all that stuff. But I think from a tangible football perspective, uh, this this really hurts Michigan State. Uh, now, Kyler Ellsworth may surprise everybody, and, and, and Darian Harrison, they may be more ready than, than anybody realizes. It may be okay. But, um, you know, the, the Stanford players and coaches talked this morning just about on film, you can see that Bull is clearly the guy that makes this all go while acknowledging that the outcome of the Rose Bowl could dramatically change the answer you're about to give to this question, what does this development do to the story of the 2013 Michigan State Spartans? Bullo represents so much of what this team is and, uh, and so much of what they've overcome and how, what they've become as a defense that, that it does blemish it a little bit. Uh, if they win, though, it'll, does it make the win even greater? I, you know, I don't know. Um, if they lose, however... Uh, because of some, you know, stupid mistake or error or whatever it, it winds up being, and we we don't know yet. I mean, it, it, to some degree, we may never know full specifics. All I, I suspect we will. Um, then, it, then I think there is something because, you know, I, I think this it, to some fans, this team's legacy is set. This is a Rose Bowl team at Michigan State, and that doesn't happen very often. It hasn't happened very often, and so even a close loss, you know, this this team has has a lure or whatever, but if they lose because something doesn't work or something's disheveled defensively, um, I think that definitely takes from it. Graham Couch from the Lansing State Journal. Thanks for the insight. We appreciate it. Anytime, Mike.